Did that just happen? Oh, I thought I caught that fly right when I switched scenes. That would have been dope. Oh, I forgot the nightmare. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh, I was kind of hoping. It... All right, hold on. Let me just switch. Oh, and I was having such a good day today. Oh. Wow, it's actually broken over there. Game. Are you going to load up game? The game's not loading up in uh, OBS. That's a bit weird. Anyways, hello everyone. Face of here and welcome to a... Today's Tuesday. Today's Tuesday. Today is a Tuesday stream. <coughs> We're going to continue playing some Doki Doki. This game is Nightmare Fuel now. Um, I don't know why it's not showing up in the capture. Um... Let's try switching things. I like that I don't see it right now because uh, it gives me the sads. Man, this game is brutal. Just Shapes and Beats, hey, welcome back. Welcome, welcome. It's good to see you again. Um, apparently, I can't load up the game. Uh, let's try this. And then we'll try this. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I, whoa! That's actually what I see right now. That big, all that weird, messed up empty area, that's exactly what I see right now. So I think when you minimize this game, it breaks it. <laughs> um, let's see if this will fix it. Yeah, now, <laughs> now you guys are out of sync. God dang it. Whoa! And the menu system's all, whoa! I wish you guys could see this right now, but the menu system is now showing up where the black stuff is that you guys see, and it's upside down, and so is the logo. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, restart it. Uh, but we're gonna be playing some more Doki Doki Literature Club, as you can see. So prep yourselves for uh, probably another nightmare in the making. Um, oh yeah, the game doesn't actually close for some stupid reason. I don't know if that's part of the game looking like it's supposed to be bugged out. Actually, you know what? It's never closed, even when I first started up the game. Hey, here you go. Here's your pillow. But, in lieu of all the bad that's gonna happen, this is what we have. We have Lunchables, you know, they're great for kids and adults alike. They bring me happy and joy. Not sponsored, but we will have some Lunchables afterwards. Um, there we go. Game showing up. All right. Feeling better. <laughs> All right. Hopefully it stays fine. Ah, it's not updating for you guys again. What the heck? This is a problem we ran into the other day. There we go. Okay, now I'm in the game. How come her name's blacked out? Dude, the game is broke. Again, big papa okay it's updating we're good we'll just hand wave it'll work glad to see you didn't run away on us ha 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 or the game crashes that was not me wait a minute was that intentional of the game because she said I'm glad to see you didn't run away on us and then it don't forget to back up Monica's character file. What the fuck is happening? Was that actually part of the game? Also, you guys aren't seeing it again. But it said, don't forget to back up Monica's character file. What is happening? All right, I'm starting to think that was actually part of the, that was coded into the game. And if it was, that's brilliant. Okay. Let's see. Hello, ah, it's all jacked up ben. again. Yeti, what's going on, my dude? Welcome to the stream. It was part of it where it just crashed. Okay. How you get big papa? Glad to see you didn't run away on us. Ha ha ha. Nah, don't, nah. Oh wait, nah, don't worry. <laughs> this might be a little strange for me, but I at least keep my word. All right, the text is okay again. Well, I'm back at the literature club. I was the last to come in, so everyone else is already hanging out. 
you guys see that? You guys didn't see that because the game isn't updating again for you. What the heck is wrong with the game? It's super broken. But, um... Okay. You see Yuri. But when Yuri came into the screen, her face had a box over it, and it flashed different faces. It was weird. <clears throat> Alright, hopefully... I'm gonna keep an eye on it to see if things are okay. This game is a nightmare. What it is, you, dude. Like, mmm. Mmm. Last night was not fun. Friend. And it's cereal coming in. What's going on, my dude? Sorry. I saw you streaming today and I lurked the whole time. I was not able to say, hey, I was way too busy at work. I saw you playing with some skull. <laughs> I, I, I was cracking up at work because I heard your conversation with skull about <laughs> he couldn't make a sandwich. The cheese sandwich. Oh. Goofy kid. Thanks for keeping- Oh wait, this is Yuri. Thanks for keeping your promise, Big Papa. Speaking of Big Papa, on my way home from work today, uh, I was behind a car and their license plate was Big Papa and it killed me. This is like, oh my gosh. Alright, you guys are seeing updates. Good. Chill out, game. I hope this isn't too overwhelming of a commitment for you. <gasps> Make you dive headfirst into literature when you're not accustomed to it. What the fuck? God, that was terrifying! That- <coughs> Excuse me. I have a curved monitor, and it looked like something coming out at me. And it scared the crap out of me. Okay, this game is nightmare fuel for a nightmare bus. It's cheese on toasted bread! That's exactly what I thought. Here, I'm sitting here in America, like... That's called a grilled cheese in America, and I know how to make that. Also, the characters seem slightly skewed. And the music gets weird every now and then. Listen. Oh, come on! Like he deserves any slack. You already had to be dragged in here by Monica. I don't know if you plan to come here and hang out or what. But if you don't take it seriously, then you won't see the end of it. Oh, God, wait. She's in front of... She's in front of the box. Uh... Natsuki, something. I have a big mouth for someone who keeps a manga collection in the club room. Why are you in front of the text box? I can't see anything. And they are skewed. They're slightly tilted. Monica! Natsuki finds herself stuck between saying Monica and manga. Oh, yeah. The me Manga's literature! Swiftly defeated, Natsuki plops back into her seat. D dude! Oh, I thought you were saying, whoa, whoa, about the game. Become an anime voice actor? Are you kidding me? <laughs> See? Ah! Ah! The music freaked out! You guys hearing that? This game is a nightmare. <sighs> uh, read that. I'm sorry, Big Papa. We'll make sure to put your effort first, or put your comfort first, okay? Yuri shoots Natsuki with a disappointed glance. <laughs> shoots her. Um, okay, anyway, now that you're in the club and all, perhaps you might have interest in picking up a book to read. Well, I can't really say no either way. Like you said, I'm in the club now. So it only feels right for me to do something like that, if you ask. Oh, wait, I didn't mean it like that. Uh, uh, if you don't really want to, then forget I said anything, I guess. Ah, uh, no, it's not that, Yuri. I want you to try to be part of this club. So even if I don't read often, I'd be happy to pick up a book if you wanted me to. Uh, uh, are you sure? I just felt like- Pew, dog! Ugh! <laughs> you stink! Well, as vice president and all, then I should keep you- Then I should help you get started in something you might like. Yuri reaches into her bag and pulls out a book. Why is the- Music getting fucked up. God, those stupid flies! I didn't want you to feel left out. I picked out a book that I thought you might enjoy. It's a short read, so I'll keep your attention even if you don't usually read. We could, you know, discuss it if you want. This is... I was checking my other monitor and I swore for a second I was watching The Exorcist. <laughs> Whew. This game, I don't know if you've played it before. This is completely blind for me and it's not okay. This game is fucked. 
Oh, there, like, I think there's like four clips now of the game, and it's fucked up. Uh, th this is. How is this girl accidentally being so cute? She even picked out a book she thinks I'll like, despite me not reading much. Yuri, thank you. I'll definitely read this. I enthusiastically take the book. Phew. Well, you can read it at your own pace. I look forward to hearing what you think. Also, right here on her wrist is all goofy pixelated. I wonder if that's because she's super zoomed in. Usually they're further away, I swear. The music's getting all wonky again. I don't like it. It sounds like there's messed up in my headset. Like, if I were to hear that normally, I would think something's wrong with my headset. I look forward to hearing what you think. Now that everyone's settled in, I expected Monica to kick off some scheduled activities for the club. Glad that I have to experience it, not you. Oh, you have seen her, never played it, or watched it. Really? You missed a ride yesterday, dude. It was, uh, it was pretty heavy and fucked up. Like, I had an entire stream of about three and a half hours of just adorable dating simulator, and then yesterday, right about the two hour and 40 minute mark into it, so we're at almost six hours, nightmare fuel got dumped all over the stream. And, uh, yeah, so if you're going to be here for a while, get ready for a ride. <coughs> hey, it's TNM. What's going on? Welcome back. Welcome back. It's good to see you. Saw your reaction to Siori in the video. Dude. Yeah, that, um, that was awful. That was not okay. You can't sleep? Yeah. Uh, cookie time. <laughs> this is not a good thing to watch before sleep. I'll tell you that. Mm. But I appreciate you being here, and let's get them doggos some cookies. Want some cookies? Say, Terry, I'll take it for them cookies. Want some cookies? Here you go. Yum, yum, yum. Jade is just standing next to me. You're such a goof. You're such a goof. I get him. All right. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Yuri's face is already bur buried in a book. I can't help but notice her intense expression, like she was waiting for this chance. And I keep bouncing in the music because it's so catchy and I like it, but. Now I'm going to have nightmares when I hear it. Meanwhile, Natsuki is rummaging around in the closet. I'm really curious to talk to Yuri a little bit more. But at the same time, I would feel bad for distracting her from reading. I catch a glimpse of the cover of her book. It looks like the same book that she lent me. More than that, she seems to be on the first few pages. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I think she knows me looking at her. Yeah, let's check her out. She sneaks another glance at me and our eyes meet for a split second. <coughs> Use me. Keep an eye on the posters in the background. Oh, that's right. And I need to open up the um the game files. Thank you for reminding me. Oh, Yuri, by the way. Or Yuri. Um, Serial, by the way. This game modifies its game files as you're playing it. And it's fucked up. It's really fucked up and scary. Um, so, and I'll, I show, I'll show them on stream if new stuff happens. But it's really fucked up. Um. Ah! There's a new thing! Oh, I don't want to open it. Oh, okay, there's a new thing, guys. It's a, it's a text document, and it's called, Can You Hear Me? All caps. It says, there's a little devil inside all of us, beneath their manufactured perception, their artificial reality is a writhing, twisted mess of dread, loathing, judgment, elitism, self-doubt, all thrashing to escape the feeble hold of their of their hosts, seeping through every little crevice they f can find, into their willpower, starving them of all motivation and desire, into their stomach, forcing them to drown their guilt in comfort food, or into a newly opened gash in their skin, hidden only by the sleeves of a cute new shirt. Ah! I've been calling that one from the beginning! Also, by the way, sorry to anyone. Um, I think I may have been insensitive. Um, by, uh, people that cut, you know, for, like, a, a release kind of thing. I've been saying cutter. I don't know if that's a, uh, insensitive term for it. Um, but I started thinking about it, and it might be, so... I'm gonna change what I'm saying. I'm not gonna call it cutter anymore. They cut, is what I'm gonna say. So, uh, I apologize if that hurt anyone's feelings or upset anyone. Uh, I will change that. Anyway, I do think Yuri cuts. And considering this last sentence in this hidden notepad file, or into newly opened gash in their skin, hidden only by sleeves of a cute new shirt. 
Such a deplorable, tangled mess is already present in every single one of them. That's why I chose choose not to blame myself for their actions. All I did was untie the knot. Is that not relating to... Uh, I don't like this game. Alright, that happy thoughts nightmare fuel is still there. Ah! Ah! <coughs> Hold on. Keep an eye on the posters in the background. I've got to go do that. Who did I? I think, um, I think Yuri actually won out, but it was really close to, uh, Yuri and Natsuki because I kept choosing ones that I thought would be Yuri, and they ended up being Natsuki. One of those lines is foreshadowing? Yeah, that's not okay. <clears throat> uh. But, but that only makes her hide her face deeper in her book. Oh, I need it. God damn it. I close that. This needs to be over here so I can watch it. Okay, so I have 15 files in my game directory right now, so if that goes up, we'll look at it. <clears throat> sorry. Oh, sorry. I was just spacing out. I'm under this sensing I made her uncomfortable. Oh, it's fine. If I was focused, then I probably wouldn't have noticed in the first place. But I'm just rereading a bit of this, so... That's the book that you gave me, right? Whoa! Her eye is... Do you guys see that? Her eye is going off the page. Of her face. What the fuck is happening? Also, there's a line under her neck. Do you guys see that? Do you guys see that? I can't tell because... You guys can see that. That's fucked up. What the hell is this game? Theory, Yuri is Tammy from Undertale? <laughs> I don't know that because I haven't played Undertale. Why is her eye moving? Was I supposed to go through this quickly and not notice that? Because I don't like it. It stopped moving. I, I'm having a hard time reading this because her eye is very off-putting right now. I wanted to reread some of it. Okay, her eyes are back. I mean, it's all good. No worries. You know, just eye detaches and, you know, the lesser-known version of de de detachable penis is uh, detachable iris. Not for, any or not for any particular reason. Just curious, how come you have two copies of the same book? I stopped at the bookstore yesterday. Uh, that's not what I meant. Keep- Ah ah! You stay there, eyeballs. Saw you wanting to move. I mean... I- I just happened to buy two of them. Mm-hmm. Uh, I see. There's something fairly obvious here that Yuri isn't telling me, but I decided to let it go. <sighs> Excuse me. I'll definitely start reading it soon. I'm glad to hear. Once it, or once it starts to pick up, you might have a hard time putting it down. It's a very engaging and relatable story. She's so happy. Is that so? What's the, what's the story about, anyway? Well... Mm. See, and she hides her hands all the time, and her arms. I look at the cover of the book. The book is entitled Portrait of Markov. That wasn't the name of the book last time, was it? I thought it was like the... something about a crimson eye. <clears throat> or was that a poem she wrote? There's an ominous looking eye symbol on the front cover. Basically, or basically it's about this religious camp that was turned into a human experiment prison. And the people trapped there have this trait that turns them into killing machines that lust for blood. Yeah, that's a different book. But the facility gets even worse and they start selectively breeding people by cutting off their limbs and fixing them to... Oh, that might be a little bit of a spoiler. No, thank you. I don't want it. 